What's going on, people? It's your boy, Kalechi, back with another episode of the Ramblin' Mind Podcast. How are each and every single one of y'all doing today? I hope y'all are taking care of yourselves. I hope y'all are doing all the things you know you ought to do during these times, my friends. Today's podcast is going to be a little bit different. Um, it's going to be me just giving some quotes and sayings that I've taken and I've heard over the years that I've had a huge impact on me. And I just want to share some of these quotes with y'all. It's not going to have any context or extra addition plugged into them or anything like that. I want you to take these quotes and decide how they may impact you for yourself, for you to use it in your life as you may choose and as you may feel it means. A lot of times when we hear people say certain things, we take on the meanings based off of what they say. But a lot of times for us, it may be something completely different or even more special. I also believe quotes and sayings or simple sayings are some of the most powerful ways to deliver ideas to people. The simpler you can make a statement, the simpler you can make an idea, the more I believe people can actually understand that idea and the more they can receive out of that idea. So here are 40 simple money and life sayings that have really impacted my life. Number one, generosity is greater than than greed. Number two, given is the truest form of wealth. Number three, pay yourself first. Number four, live below your means. Number five, which is attached to number four, invest early and often. Number six, never stop learning. Number seven, debt is a two-edged sword. Fear it. Number eight, boring wins. Number nine, play your game. Number 10, more is not always better. Number 11, this is a quote from Morgan Housel. Wealth is the difference between what you have minus what you want. Number 12, freedom is the ultimate form of wealth and it doesn't take that much to achieve it. Number 13, give more. Number 14, save like a pessimist, invest like an optimist. That's by Morgan Housel. Number 15, less is more. Number 16, fight for simplicity because complexity will find you, especially in your finances. Number 17, question everything but remain curious. Number 18, Price is what you pay. Cost is what you live with. Number 19. Sales are designed to move old products, not help me save money. Number 20. No one cares. Number 21. Scarcity sucks, but scarcity by choice is how you build wealth. Number 22. Investing is the only game where doing nothing is how you succeed. Number 23, cash is trash until I need it. Number 24, not all good advice is good for me. Number 25, the grass is always greener on the side that's fertilized with bullshit. That's by Morgan Housel again. Number 26, when you understand compounding, your entire life changes. Number 27, Self-interest is the only way to appeal to people. Number 28, incentives trump ethics. That's by Charlie Munger. Number 29, predictions are never right. History tells you all you need to know. Number 30, one in a million chance occurrences happen every day. It just didn't happen to you. Number 31, there are many ways to become wealthy but only one to stay wealthy. Number 32, increase your income and then stop. Number 33, seriously, no one cares. Number 34, give even more. Number 35, low expectations leads to more wealth and happiness. That's Morgan Housel. Number 36, begin with the end in mind. That's by Stephen Covey. Number 37, no one knows what they are doing, so you might as well trust yourself. 
Number 38, my inability to sit with my thoughts leads to all my problems. That is a adjusted quote from Blaise Pascal. Number 39, discipline is freedom. That is by Jacko Willick. And number 40, faith is trusting a God I know on a path I do not know. That's Chris Langham. And finally, the most important saying of them all, it is well. I hope these help you in one shape, form, or fashion. For me, these are some of the quotes that have had a very huge impact on my life in one shape or another. I'm pretty sure there's a bunch more. I have a, an entire folder full of quotes. I will share these in the future. Uh, some of these, I don't know who said them. I've just kind of collected them over time. And when I began collecting some of these, I didn't put the quote who said it. And I apologize to anyone who I'm choosing to plagiarize. But I hope this helps you. And I hope you take one, maybe two out of this entire list of saying. But anyway, that's all I got for y'all in this episode. I hope y'all learned one, maybe two things out of this entire thing. And if you did, share this podcast with one person that you love, one person that you hate, and one person you're just kind of like about. And by that time, you would have shared it with every single person that you know. But it's been your boy Kalechi. I'm going to catch y'all up on the next one. Remember, generosity is always greater than greed. God bless each and every single one of y'all. And I'm out. Peace.